Hello and welcome back to Jarvis Johnson Gold, Gold. the premium channel that is free. Uh, it is it is free, but if you're watching this, you're premium. And today we're talking about the female gaze. I can't do it. Uh, but have you seen the TikToks of the guy making the sexy face? And then everybody went, ooh, sexy guy. Kind of. Well, that's what we're talking about today. What is the female gaze? We'll try to figure that out today. But first, I want to introduce you to Kevin. This is Kevin. He's kind of a guy. Uh, in fact, I never would have believed that this guy was TikTok's new heartthrob. But TikTok works in mysterious ways. And that's not no slight against Kevin. I'm sure he's pleasant, except for some of the stuff we'll talk about. Let me just show you Kevin's shtick. So that's his thing. He does a little lip syncing and he seems really awkward. Oh, ooh, how'd I end up in this situation? And then he does little sexy eyes and he goes, ooh, I wanna fuck you." And then he goes, golly gee, how did I end up here? And then he ends the video. And then he does that on repeat. And everyone is losing their minds. Who is Kevin, the female gaze perfectionist on TikTok? What is the Kevin gaze? People can't decide if the trend is, this is Newsweek. <laughs> People can't decide if the trend is sexy or creepy. This is Kevin, okay? And in one viral video, Kevin has managed to accomplish something that women have been trying to explain for a very, very long time. The difference between the male and female gaze. I could fully just live in a bubble. I do not know if the female gaze is something that has been being tried to explain for a long time. So here's the video. So if, if you get it, you get it, right? So I... I'll look this up, but my understanding of the male gaze is not a literal gaze, but like the concept of, you know, dressing or or tailoring your appearance for the male eye to appeal to to appeal to men. Right? That's I think what the male gaze is. The male gaze. Describes a way of portraying and looking at women that empowers men while sexualizing and diminishing women. In feminist theory, I guess. Now, the female gaze? In contemporary usage, the female gaze has been used to refer to the perspective of female filmmaker, screenwriter, director, producer that brings to a film that may be different from a male view of the subject. Also, that is intuitive that makes sense to me the literal female gaze still have no idea what they're talking about is it just looking with sexy eyes <laughs> is it just like i can't i can't do the face okay there's a lot of people that try to do the face on tiktok and it's very awkward in fact i think it's awkward when the expert kevin does it uh, but that's just me i guess what they're trying to say about kevin is that he's making a face that you know, women find attractive, I guess. Not everyone feels that way, but I guess that's what they're getting at. Is that a lot of typically and socially attractive men are trying to accomplish the same thing by like either duetting it or just doing the trend on their own. And I'm telling you, till now, I don't think anyone is close at getting it just right like Kevin did. So here's an example. Do you guys see what I mean? Finally, we now have an example of what 
we mean when we talk about the difference. What? <laughs> I just have, I'm not privy to this conversation. Starting out, I wasn't attracted to Kevin. Then the eyes and jaw movement and boom, I'm having Kevin's baby. I went through the trend last night. Kevin seems like he'd do anything to make me happy versus the second guy seems like he only wants me to make him happy. What are we doing? <laughs> This is reading so much into this. And I don't know why TikTok does this thing or just the internet does this thing where we place a lot of value into an individual. We like sort of raise them up. Now we're praising Kevin for his eyes or, or whatever. His like, fuck you, uh, fuck me eyes. And the issue with that is Kevin is a flawed individual before he stumbled upon doing lip syncing and doing the eye thing, which now he won't stop doing. Uh, well, first, let's get a few example, a few more examples of that. I'm just playing, ladies. You know I love you. He's so quirky. Oh, how does he do it to me? I'm having Kevin's baby. I, it's, I, it comes off that I'm j jealous and bitter about Kevin, which, you know, yes, I am. I can't do the thing with my eyes. My eyes are bad. If I try to look sexy, it, it's just weird. Now, Kevin has a lot of a lot of stands. He's got 3 million followers on TikTok now. And I think that a lot of that growth was very recent, but not everybody's into Kevin, uh, which is okay. You know, there's not everyone can be for everyone. You can't outdo the doer. This is who y'all said mastered the female gaze. Is this all part of a sick joke that I'm not in? Like, like, honestly, I don't get it. Like, if this is a joke, please let me. Like, there's no way the comments are real. Stop! <laughs> I forgot about that one. Another thing about Kevin is that he does these lives that um, don't, to me, capture the magic the same way that his TikToks do. Um, so I found a, a live stream that Kevin did on Twitch from four days ago, or at least it was up. It was, yeah, it was streamed on this channel four days ago. And it's, it, to me was a big character reveal. Uh, I'm a little bit like, is this your King? Uh, I don't know guys. <clears throat> It's cause he has Sampaku eyes. That that is it. He's just a regular white man and with Sampaku eyes. I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't. All I'm gonna say, all I'm gonna say, your beef is a not Chat, please, just let me have this one, please. Please, just let me, chat, please. Please let me have this one, please. I need it. I've had a bad day yesterday. I need it. Okay, okay, I won't. All right, all right, all right, all right. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub, Tess. I won't do it. Chat, move on, move on, move on, move on, move on. Mama. All I'm saying is your beef ain't with me. It's with Mike Tyson, whoever the fuck knocked your lip like that. Oh, come on. Let me talk to you if I was your boyfriend. So I Oh, here we go, bro. Here we go, brother. Here we fucking go. Now go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Wait, so he's calling her Lindsay Lohan? I don't get I don't get it. Why is he so petty? Like, so I, I kinda get the appeal from that perspective, that it's not like a creepy gaze, it's like a nice, kind of appealing, inviting gaze. Um, is this his idea of humor? Maybe, maybe that's it. Cause I'm, I'm 43 and I've dated a lot of guys. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. How old she said she was? 43? She's lived double my life. Oh, uh, I don't know why he has to. Okay. All right. Whatever. Here we go. Aren't we just saying that this is the face that guys make when they're about to kiss you and like it's really cringe and now they're saying that this is the female gaze?
What? What the fuck is that supposed to? Oh, he's trying to... Wait, he's making fun of her nose? Bro, fuck off, dude. Fuck off. What? 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 Oh, be careful, Kevin. Oh, people aren't going to like that joke. I wonder why. Oh, uh-oh, the chat. The chat's telling him to be careful. Stop being so edgy. Stop making fun of the black woman's nose, Kevin. You might get into a little bit of trouble. What? What did I do? Chat, you, got, you guys can't, can't make up your mind, bro. I don't know what you guys want from me. I didn't do anything fucking wrong. She wasn't even making fun of him. She wasn't even making fun of him. She was just saying that, like, TikTok discourse has evolved weirdly. It wasn't even about him. I don't understand why he's so thin-skinned that he's assuming that people are, you know, coming at him when they're just commenting on a clearly viral moment. It's like you want this to happen. You are reaping all the benefits. You're doing a thousand videos of you fucking, I fucking the fucking camera. And then you get upset when people like have discourse around it, whether or not they're into it or not. I don't understand. And maybe, maybe he's not getting upset, but making jokes about how this black woman has big lips or how this other black woman, oh, weird coincidence, her nose looks like a shotgun barrel. Like, fuck off, actually. Um, and this is not even addressing the fucking misogynistic content that he's done. I to seduce you. Would you like me to seduce you? I swear to God, if he makes fun of another black woman's appearance. We get it. We get it. We get it. What are you even? I don't even understand what the point of reacting to this is. What do you expect to gain if we get it. No, we, we, we're we tired of seeing you. Don't flip this on us. No one, no one who's even taught, most of the people even talking about this aren't even saying that he's not attractive. They're just saying, I don't get it, right? Or they're just saying, this isn't for me. And then he's going out of his way to like make fun of their appearance. You can't outdo the doer. This man is about to get addicted to absinthe and start writing poems about ravens. Just a thought. Get it, okay. You can't. Bro, I'm not gonna lie. We do not care. <laughs> what? I don't understand, dude. What is? Why is he reacting to himself on stream? If he doesn't care, dude. I just. No one is asking you to react to yourself on stream, dude. Do some other content if you so choose. But it's a weird look to look at everyone who's just engaging in the trend that is about your face and then being like fuck it who fucking cares <laughs> i don't even fucking did anybody who asked okay so this brings me to some of kevin's older tiktoks i i'm already going to get demonetized but i don't want this video to get suppressed so i'm not going to show them because it is like kind of dark and i feel like youtube might have an issue with it but essentially there's a few um of kevin's old TikToks that are dark humor. Trigger warning on this, by the way, because even describing this is gross. In one of the videos, he comes home after a long day, puts his head on his girlfriend's stomach, feels kicking. There's a caption that says feels kicking. And then he, you know, beats his girlfriend up and then she spits out like tomato soup or something like that. Now, I don't have the full context because all these live streams keep disappearing and clips keep getting mass reported and stuff like that. So it's hard to find everything. But allegedly this clip is of him denying that the videos in question are about him. This is a fucking crazy look, bro. Not only are y'all attacking the gay man, but y'all are confusing him with another Arab man. Yo, this is psychotic. This is... Terrible. This is such a bad fucking yo chat. I don't know, I'm not even joking. This is such a bad look. <laughs> this is such a fucking bad look. Yo, people are all over the internet shitting on me because they think that I'm this person. This is insane, dude. This is fucking crazy. When he got banned from Twitch, I mean, he's said uh, on a number of occasions that he is, um, that he's gay. 
which doesn't really have any bearing on like the content of what he's done in the past but may put into context some of the other like allegations apparently he was banned from twitch for being homophobic and i don't know what i can't find any evidence of like what that was i just know he's tweeted about it and talked about it on live streams but yeah so all of this is like hearsay and there's a lot of like mass reporting going on i know he has a big discord server that i haven't tried you know getting inside uh but um I will say, let me just see if I can find the Discord server. Wait, did he get banned while I'm... What? Yo, wait, did he just get banned like while I'm recording? All right, well, I guess that's where I'm going to end this quick video for right now. Um... I don't know if I'll talk about this again, but I, uh, it's something I wanted to, to touch on. All right, bye. Yo, recording this with my shotgun barrels right here. I just wanted to quickly say, because I forgot to say this in the original video, do do not harass um, Kevin. The reason that I included his tweets is be, without like blurring the name or anything like that is so that it's like verify, verifiably coming from him. And I don't wish him any ill will. I don't want any of you to, to reach out to him. Uh, I'm more talking about this from a TikTok trend and its aftermath perspective. Um, so yeah, I'm not trying to like go after the guy. So please no one take that from this.